Hey y'all, Serlu here, and we are back again with Nightcry. So last time we did some awesome, pretty badass stuff. Uh, Rooney here stepped up to the plate. She dodged darts. She found some VIP cards and some billiard balls. And we had a weird <laughs> freaking bar room that was hidden away up there that had some, it had the billiard ball and it had uh, like this coat rack with arms on it and. Ugh, oh, it was weird. And a haunted jukebox. Had a haunted jukebox that just magically turned on. I don't want to think about that too much. I feel like there was something right there that I could have clicked. That! Oh, it's just a poster. I don't care about your damn posters. We are off to, um... Oh wait, that was the place I needed to go though, wasn't it? Never mind, I'm sorry. We got this, um, key here from... Yes, I know I can't use it standing still. I want to click on things. Oh, that's annoying the crap out of me. Since the last update, like some every other time that I click on like an object, it will say, oh, you can't use that there, even though I haven't clicked on anything with the fucking object. Oh, you can't use that there. Oh, so it must be in the movie theater then. Because he said it was like um, at the end of the mile, at the end of the aisle in the movie theater. Having trouble getting my words out today. Let's see. It's not that door, is it? I don't know. I, for some reason, I believe this was a wall before, but... No, it looks like a door. Let's see. If not, we can go in the movie theater and see what door is in there. Nope, this is the one. Awesome. Well, that's all good. So, let's get out there. But yeah, Vigo is just kind of... Chilling with the rest of the passengers and nobody's suspicious of him whatsoever, even though our snap post thing says that uh, he should not be trusted according to Jerome? Wait, no, go back. Don't you fucking run away, girl. Come on. <laughs> Is that your that's Jerome? What the fuck? What the fuck? Aren't you off on an island somewhere? He should be on the island right now, shouldn't he? Because, do your students, the person with the artificial eye, unless he can't be back already, right? How much fucking time is passing right now? Because I'm so lost. You'd think that traveling to an island in a rowboat would take some time, but... I don't know. What else did we have there? We had the murder in the Oceanus. That's, um, Monica's post. So, Monica's somewhere with itches, and he's already back here, and he's awake. What the fuck? Was he just, like, gone and passed out for an hour? This is so fucking weird. Yo, Jerome. Um, Jerome, you got out safely? Yeah, it's pretty fucking suspicious. I did, and you see... Wait. Pause that. I did, and you. You seem to have gotten out with only a few scratches. Thank goodness. Needed to adjust there. All thanks to your help. I even managed to meet up with uh, other people in my group. That's great! And your friends are safe too, I take it? Yeah, they are. They are stowed away with you along with the other passengers in the cargo hold. Don't tell them where he they are! Don't! So they're with the other passengers. Is that so? Hmm. You're being, uh, you look conflicted. You also seem to be behaving very suspiciously. Oh, well, you see, after I saw you off, I was attacked by a group of masked hoodlums. I would not refer to them as hoodlums, but... Some were wearing regular passenger attire, and some were donning crew uniforms. I managed to get away, but I'm sure they're involved in this incident somehow. You know how they're involved. We've got to try and uncover whatever it is they're plotting. Hmm... I ain't trusting you, Jerome. Seriously, because remember back when we were playing as Leonard, he had all those like engravings on his back, and some of them were fresh, but some of them were old, so he definitely has dealt with the cult already. He knows what's going on here. I'm like 100% sure he knows what's going on. Are you saying that the monster has allies among the passengers and crew? Yes, well, I'm not sure if they're allies, but there are several dodgy characters out there for sure. And since they're passing themselves off as both passengers and crew members, it's hard to tell them apart from regular people. And yeah, we got our contact info for him. Is that it? I'm going to look around a little more, see if I can dig up what that masked bunch is up to. 
I'd rather you hide yourself somewhere safe. Why the fuck do you care? I know some people who are still out there. I've got to find them. Yeah, Rennie, you tell them. I see. Please don't take any risks. Don't worry, Jerome. We won't. We won't. Alright, that's it then? So you gotta say to us? I really don't trust him. He's like super suspicious. It's just, it's bothering me a little. <laughs> like, I don't know if he's... It's like he acts suspicious and he seems to have dealt with the cult before, but even then, I don't know if he's actually trying to help us. Because he does seem to have a thing for... Great. Can we knock it down then? No, you can jump. Well, jump, girl. Woo! Parkour now, huh? You getting all hot kinds of hardcore, girl. She Seriously, she, she's shaping up nicely. I am enjoying the female characters in this game. Leonard was kind of stale, but, uh... You know, he, he served his purpose. But the girls, they are, like, proving to be very... Oh, no. Oh, no. Are we trapped? Oh. Suspicious. Jessica. You are dead right now for sure, 100%. Hi, Rini. It's me, Jessica. Don't trust that Eric guy. He's dangerous. Mm. You're not alive. Just listen. Whatever you do, be careful around that Eric guy. Got that, Jessica? Jessica? Silence. Eric was, um... Eric and Kobe were with uh, Leonard. Okay, so this has to be... After Lennox gotten off the island, right? If they're back already... This is confusing, because wasn't there like some big-ass explosion that happened? Like when they got back to the ship? I don't know, we should be seeing that if they're back here already with Jerome, because Jerome's up there, he's dressed. In his normal clothes, too, which kind of fucking weird, right? Because they're all like, get this man a jacket. He's all shirtless and stuff. But now he's back in his normal clothes. This is so fucking weird, right? What we got here? Cargo. Chemical fertilizer. I heard once the chemical fertilizer can be used for making explosions. Could this have some connection from... When did you witness the explosion? Because, you know, we've been with you since the whole thing went down and we haven't seen no fucking explosions, Rooney. Like, we didn't even feel the ship shake or nothing. I don't- Anyone recall this? Because I don't recall this. <laughs> like, this is why I'm so confused with the fucking timeline. Because we're getting shit. Like, people are showing back up on the- Wait a moment. Wait a moment. Give me a second. Okay, so I'm back and I was looking back through some, like, the old videos real quick. I was just checking and so, okay, let me pull this up. According to this, it's like 9.03. Oh wait, that's my real time. Okay, never mind. I was being stupid. I thought that was showing us, like, the time on the ship and that completely distracted me because I was like, wait one gosh damn minute. At 9.44 is when Leonard went off to the island. Why the fuck is everybody here? <laughs> uh, that's stupid. Okay. So yeah, it's 9.04. <laughs> I record my stuff early in the morning. So forgive me if I'm like super out of it or non-observant of things. <laughs> but uh, yeah. Um, anywho, let's uh, get this all done. Where, where am I? I don't even know where I am. What am I looking for? That's the cargo thing. We already saw that. Is there anything back here? Any interest? Oh, there is something of interest. Ah, uh, that don't sound- THAT DON'T SOUND GOOD AT ALL! Okay, yep, we are, uh... DODGE! It wasn't so much as a dodge as a fall and alarm, but it, it works, Rooney. It works. Oh shit. ARE YOU FUCKING KIDDING ME?! <laughs> oh, you fucker. You fucker right there. Oh, screw you. What's that? Ah, get off! Get off! Get off! Get off. Is that an escape? Please let that be an escape for us. Fuck you! What was it? Where'd it go? That thing! Use it! Get the hell out of here! 
I don't know what it is, but it's working. Oh, it's like a conveyor belt. Oh, yeah, like he's totally not going to freaking get up and start. I called it! Call the shit! <laughs> oh, oh, run, 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 run! No, 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 Go! Oh, go! God damn it, stop screaming and run! You're wasting air, girl! Haha, fuck you! Ah, nice. All good? Go on, you can give the freaking scissor walker the bird, Rooney. None of us will judge you. Uh, <laughs> that's so stupid. Okay, well, that was a good enough way to escape shit, I guess. Seriously? Like, we only went through the other side of a mesh container, I think. You would think it would notice this, right? Oh, well. Let's get on out of here and nothing in there. Uh-oh. Whoa! Oh, oh. Uh, What's that? What was that? Was that supposed to be our explosion? Huh? That seems like it should have been an explosion. All this shit's really weird. <laughs> like the timeline is so fucked up here. I don't even. Right, this isn't leaning back the way we came, is it? I feel like this is leaning back the way we came. There's something in there. A moment. Yeah, there is something in there. What is it? A necklace is lying on- No! Is that Monica's? Oh, no, 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 not Monica. Yes, it's on- Oh, shit. Monica, you must be nearby, but where exactly? Is she in one of the containers? Can we pick it up? Give it back to her later? Oh, nope, we cannot. She's- Yeah, probably in one of the containers. Uh, let's see if we can go find it. Damn it, nothing. Anything? Monica? What the hell is this? A colossal heavy duty shutter completely blocks the path. Switch on the side, looks like it operates the shutter. I do not think it's going to be that simple. Especially considering there was like something. I'm pretty sure the switch, whatever. See what else we got. Was there anything in the container that the scissor walker came out of? Oh, that was his container. My bad. Wasn't it? Oh, we're not even in the same part. Okay, that doesn't matter. Um, stuff over here. Those look like boxes and some things. Wooden box. Yeah, because that's not obvious. <laughs> it's unclear why someone felt that was necessary. See, I cannot talk today. See, it's over here. A remote con- A what? Upon closer inspection, it says crane. Oh, okay. There are several cranes installed on the ceiling. Maybe that's what it refers to. Better take it just in case. I bet I know what this does. Because I have a feeling about something. Because you see, when we looked over here, I noticed- Like, let me show you. Let me show you. See this? That's kind of weirdly lit up, isn't it? To draw the eye. Hmm. And if y'all notice, there are, mm -hmm, there are ladders on this. I think I know what I'm supposed to do. Um, that's a door that's locked firmly tight. Yes, it is, but okay, good. There's a ladder. We can climb the ladder. I was getting worried there for a minute. Could have gone really badly. All right, let's get on up there. I don't think that's far enough up. Okay, let's go on over. Hold on, Rooney. Look at her flailing. Alrighty. Up a little more, you say? I don't want to crush her now. There we go. Woo! Kick ass. So we can ride shipping containers now. And all the glorious, glorious things. Let's see. So, hmm. Er, come on, girl. God damn it. So we have been going down. So Monica should be down here, but that also means that uh, Itches is probably down here. 
And seeing as how her necklace was in a container with some blood outside of it, I'm getting some bad feelings about that. <laughs> I don't want Monica to be dead. She's awesome. What do we got over here? Anything? Anything? Oh shit! Holy crap! <laughs> oh, that's not who I think it is, is it? Oh, it's fucking Kobe. Oh, son of a bitch, he killed him. He killed him! And the- Oh, this is confusing. Cause, yes, that's era Kobe the person or whatever. Um, although unfortunately I'll have to describe him in the past tense since he's dead. Fuck you, Eric. Question is... We got that phone call from the scissor walker that said... You know, Jessica is, um... Yeah, we got the phone call from the Scissor Walker posing, at Jess posing as Jessica that said that Eric should not be trusted. But we can't trust the Scissor Walker. We know the Scissor Walker is the one freaking mimicking Jessica. So, I don't know. Should we talk to you? Oh, you're Miss Simpson, right? Miss Rudy Simpson, wasn't it? And you, and you're now I remember uh, something. Yes, I'm Chief Purse Eric. Um, yeah. I'm acquaintance of Professor. Oh, okay, oh, come on. I cannot get words out today. I was with an acquaintance of yours, Professor Laird, up until just now, but things got out of control and I was thrown overboard. That's a fucking lie, you mask wearing piece of shit. In fact, I've only gotten. something. <laughs> you are the professor? Where is he? Calm down, Miss Simpson. I don't know where he is myself. We went ashore on the island in search of clues, and suddenly I was thrown overboard. Somehow I managed to find my way back on board. The professor was thrown into the sea as well. So the professor is most likely dead. Who knows what became of him? The waves weren't particularly high, so perhaps he survived. This is really fucking weird. Like, I don't know. It's getting kind of surreal now, with Drum on the stairway and... These guys in a random little room off by themselves. I'm pretty sure Kobe wasn't part of this. Did the monster do this? Um, no. This was drowning. The sea called for him. He was with me with and the professor on the boat. Of course he was thrown into the sea with the rest of us. I managed to drag him aboard somehow and tried resuscitation, but it was too late. I'm sorry. So is this supposed to be water, or should I be concerned about his corpse? Coming alive as like scissor monstery. Okay, so Eric, what are you doing here? Well, I managed to get myself this far, but now I'm stuck. I was thinking about moving through the air ducts. Ah, uh, yes. However, it seems the power for the elevator is cut off, so we would just end up stuck in another area. So, is there a way to bring the power back online? Maybe if the electrical machinery below us could be repaired, and something, then we have to no time to waste. Yeah, we gotta repair that shit. Okay, it won't work. The control panel is on the floor above us. Um, and to get there, you have to get the elevator moving, so... Yeah, chicken before the egg, whatever. I don't trust you. Where's your scratchy marks? I know they're there. Um, we're out of luck. If only there was a way to get to the upper floor. I think I have an idea, because there's, like, a thing over here. Yeah, this thing. <coughs> Pardon me. Um, it's an air duct. Yep. Can we... Can we get that? Yep, so filthy. Can we not then climb this? Yeah, next to the ceiling you've been. Can't we get up there through that? No? Do you have any ideas, Eric? I mean, I'm not supposed to trust you, but I might trust you. Um, if only we could get in touch with the upper floor. Oh, duh! And I don't have the smoke phone. What to do? Mmm, I don't like him. Oh, right. Maybe we can call... I just want to see if Monica picks up real quick. It did not go through. Um... Shit, do we risk Kelly? I don't want to risk her, but... Hey, Rooney, that you? Have you found uh, the professor? No, not yet, but I have a favor to ask you. It's going to be risky. But we do... There should be a switchboard in your cargo hood. Oh, okay. Well, that's easy. Um, well, I know it when I see it. I don't know shit about machines. Uh, you will. It should be okay. I can't get to the upper floor without your help. Okay, I'll give it a shot. 
I'm counting on you, Kelly. Awesome. Right? All good? Uh, I just got done with your favor. Okay, that was like a weird transition. Really? Yeah. Open the switchboard, sucker up, and uh, didn't know what I was looking for. I had Angie, whatever. Husband select struggle engineer. She picked up some stuff from him. Good. Thanks. Hey, so it's all good. Oh, that's lovely. Happy now? Thank you. We stand a good chance of getting the power back on thanks to your friends. Now we should be able to get that elevator running too. Okay, now do we go up through this? Are you going to go through the air duct? I mean, you said we should, right? If you've wrapped up everything on this side, you should probably be okay. Maybe we should go look for some stuff. Scale of the damage from the explosion is clear, but um, good chance that area will be flooded as well. well that's no good, is it? Guess we should go and explore and see what we can find first. See if there's anything else out here. Okay, yeah, see, we would have missed this. There's another room. Could Monica be in here? Monica? Monica? Nope, it is empty. Well, this is useless. We'll have an empty room. Anything else? Anything? No, that's the stairs we came down from. Alright, I think we are all good here then. Alright, yeah, not that, nothing else. Alright, we should be good here. Oh, but we are out of time! Again! Damn it! Um, but yeah, let's see. So, I really don't know what to think about Eric, because we know for sure that he was the one wearing the mask on the boat when the explosion went off with Leonard and all that, so we know that he is a traitor. But we also have the fact that the scissor walker told us not to trust him. Which makes us think, you know, we should trust him, but then again, what well, if the scissor walker is expecting us to think that, and it's fucking with our heads, and all this crazy shit. Oh, I don't get this game. And then the time frame is like all the fucking over the place. I just, I have no idea what's going on. Like, She's like, oh, maybe that's what, you know, the explosion that I heard earlier was about and stuff. And it's all like, uh, the explosion happened after you said that. So it doesn't make any sense. Unless uh, so we weren't supposed to read that shipping container until after we triggered that. But I don't know how we were. That's like the first thing we saw when we walked into the room. It, it's just, maybe it's poor planning. Who knows? But, um, yeah. So Kobe's dead over here. Eric is being untrustworthy and suspicious over here. Jerome is off somewhere else being suspicious and untrustworthy. And, um, Kelly and the others are all hold up nice and safe. And Monica is very unsafe and Leonard might be dead, so who knows? Um, in the next episode, we will attempt to repair this mysterious elevator and get everything back on track. So, you know, like and subscribe if you want to. And thank you for watching. <laughs>